What's up y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, thanks for checking the girl out. As you can tell from the title, I'm coming to you again with another haul. This time it's from, let me get the bag. <laughs> another drill. Boo. I promise I only made one order and I got two bags so this should be good when I got the two bags I was just like uh what the hell did I order I didn't quite remember exactly what I ordered so I went ahead and looked over my invoice and I feel like this is going to be a good haul because I got clothing I got swimwear I got shoes accessories and a bag so this should be a nice well-rounded haul so I'm going to go ahead and start to show you the pieces this is the very first set and I really like this. I really, really like this. Let me step back so you guys can see everything. It is a two-piece coordinate set, so it's a separate top and bottom. I love the shade of yellow that it's in. I think it's really nice. I love the frills on the shorts. I love that it's a tie crop top. I think it's very cute and feminine. I do, however, wish it wasn't as paper thin as it is, okay? Because this thing is thin, thin, okay? This is thin, thin, okay? Let me turn around one second. Do you see that? Y'all can see the tag through the clothing. Why? Why can you see the tag? Like, it doesn't need to be this thin. I can see my nips through this, and it's not even daytime. This is nighttime, okay? With that being said, <laughs> I think I'll still keep it. Here we have the next item, and it is this red leopard jumpsuit. Um, the fabric is kind of weird, I'm not gonna lie. It feels weird, but it looks good, so I'll give it a pass. You know what I'm saying? It's one of those things where it's like, you don't know what's going on unless you're like in it. If I come in close, the top part doesn't lay flat against my chest. It does have some weird gathering at the back, so there's a lot of extra space back here. It's just weird. The fabric is really weird. It doesn't really stretch. Like, it stretches, but it doesn't stretch and hug at the same time. You know what I mean? It's just too much extra fabric in it. I still think it's a cute item. I just don't feel like it lays as flattering as most bodysuits that I own do. But I can still finesse with it. So here's the next item. It is this cute-ass coral crochet top it is so nice y'all i love this so much it's giving me sexy under boob cleavage in a nice tasteful way i'm loving that i love the design by now you guys should know i will be in trinidad for carnival so i really you know say you know i just you know i just want to stunt i just want to stunt one time just stunt just once just once i just want to stunt once okay and i feel like these two actually look really good together i think it's so cute and perfect for where i'm going and just the vibe i'm trying to give off all right so here are the next two items and the first one is just a simple triangle black bikini top as you can see like my boobs are sitting really nicely in it nothing is spilling out uncomfortably it's sitting nice and low and like no side spillage. It's a really nice bikini top and, you know, like the back open. The next item we have is this skirt. This is, I think, it's, is this leopard? Oh, I always get them mixed up, but it is this animal print skirt with a high slit, which I think is super cute, super sexy. Um, it comes all the way to the ground on me, which is amazing. So if I wear heels, it will still give me like a nice little flow action with it. This skirt has mad potential. And then just these two together, a total look total look it's super cute super nice for like a beach party a day party you know one of those this is the next item and it's um a little sexy but i love it okay this is a very nice cute take on a beach cover-up it is a crochet like beach skirt so i just went ahead and put on this bodysuit so you guys could see the detail like it's so cute like ah, yes listen and if you want to like you know you know shake a little something something trust me these these frills they're gonna be moving okay if you moving they're gonna be moving too <laughs> so i actually really love this item the next few items are just accessories shoes and swimwear so i went ahead and did some cutaway so you guys can see what they look like here we have this two-piece leopard bikini and honestly this is so cute on it is so cute on the, the bra fits me perfectly, my boobs aren't spilling out, and the straps are adjustable on the shoulders, so I'm able to lift my give my boobs a little lift if I need to, or release the tension if it's a little too tight. I love that. The bottoms are really cute, they're full coverage as well, they're high-waisted, which I think it works really nicely with this bathing suit. It has a nice cutout in the back. So the next items are these high-waisted bikini bottoms. They are super full coverage. It's cute, like they're cute. They're not my favorite and they're kind of big on me so I won't be keeping these. Uh, they have this weird gaping at the back. There's just a lot of extra fabric and it doesn't sit nicely on me. It's just not very flattering. So that's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Okay, y'all, this bathing suit, I was really trying to give y'all Baywatch, but make it black. <laughs> it has a low cut at the back. Really cute, 
just doesn't fit. There's a lot of extra fabric between my back and my butt. It doesn't sit nicely against my body. It doesn't hug my body nicely. It's just, it just, the, it's just not flattering. It's just not a flattering bathing suit on me. So that's unfortunate because I really feel like it could have been a moment had it fit properly, but because it doesn't fit, it's just not gonna work. The next item I got was this wristlet bag honestly it's just a plain black bag i don't have any of these in my collection and i wanted to just have a really nice simple one that was big enough to hold my phone lip gloss and like my purse it's just a classic you know bag it, it was really inexpensive it doesn't look cheap uh it doesn't feel cheap i think it's just a nice basic to have in my wardrobe so i went ahead and picked it up so the next item i got were these shoes and i got it in both black and this caramel beige color super cute these were super inexpensive honestly i do not recommend sony cameras <laughs> man i can't wait to upgrade but anyways my camera cut out uh, i don't know what i was saying but i think i was saying that i bought these shoes because they're comfortable and i'll be doing a lot of partying and just a lot of movement while i'm out in trinidad and i didn't want to carry my really nice sturdy flat so i wanted to buy something that was cheap and uh, still look cute but if they got damaged I wouldn't be too mad. Black and brown basically go with everything, and this is just a nice classic style. I feel like it will go with pretty much all, if not most, of my outfits. Okay, so the next item I got were these shoes. Uh, the shoes itself, it looks good. Uh, the heels feel sturdy, but it just, it feels cheap. Like it looks good, but it feels cheap. There's glue, you can see, let me come in close. I don't know if y'all can see, but there's like glue here. You can see the glue along the heel. And that's just like very disappointing because the style itself is cute, but the construction and just the quality of the shoe overall is just not that great. The last two items I got were just some earrings. I got a tortoiseshell earring and I got just a classic gold hoop earring, but it's a more chunky one. I love this. It gives me like 90s vibes. And I love that this is back in style because this is just so cute to me. Um, and I really love earrings. I have like a... I have a collection of earrings at this point. I really need to stop buying earrings, but they're like my favorite accessories, just earrings or something on my wrist. And that's about it. So yeah, these are cute. They caught my eye. They weren't expensive at all and they look really nice. All right, so that is it for my Boohoo haul. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give me a thumbs up. Also leave a comment. Let me know what item was your favorite from this haul. I love when you guys interact with me. So be sure to leave a comment. It makes me like so happy. So please do. <laughs> Let me know if you ever ordered from Boohoo and what your experience was like. Overall, I think kind of like Fashion Nova and Pretty Little Things is very much a hit or a miss. You either really like the items or you just want to send it back. So that was my experience at least as my as a first time buyer. But with that being said, if you'd like to see more content from me, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already, okay? I upload every Monday, which means I will bless your timeline every single Monday. So be sure to go ahead and subscribe and I'll see you next Monday. All right, thanks for watching, bye. Whoa, sis, that is not okay. What we're not going to do is act like that's not a problem. That's not what we're going to do.